Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I wash Kai's curly hair um, using the dark and lovely all natural moisture lock method. These are all the products that I'm going to be using in her hair for this wash routine. I um, have them shown in order that I'm going to use them and I'll show you close-ups again. So let's go ahead and get started. So typical to washing hair, we're going to start with getting it wet and just getting it as wet as possible to really just wet down the hair and allow the product to soak in better. We're going to begin with shampooing. We are using the Sulfate Free Cleansing Shampoo. As you can see, I apply a generous amount to my hands and I'm just really um, massaging her hair and rubbing it downwards and trying not to disturb her curls too much because the more you disturb the curls, the frizzier they tend to be for her at least, and the more that they get tangled. So I'm just gonna to continue to work that in and then rinse it out once I have a good lather. And we are going to go ahead and repeat the same steps again as we wash her hair one more time because I do like to do it twice. I feel it gets cleaner and it gets all of the product out from the previous hairstyle that we had before. condition her hair with a deep conditioning delight as you can see I use a lot of conditioner because her hair does get frizzy but I like to make sure that it moisturizes that much as much as possible so I go ahead and massage that into her scalp without moving her curls around too much or really tangling them up that way when I move into my detangling step it doesn't hurt her too bad and doesn't rip at her hair either Now the conditioner thoroughly worked into her hair, I'm going to begin detangling with my wet brush. This is the detangling wet brush that I am using and I'm starting from the bottom of her hair and working my way up. That way I don't really rip and pull at her hair and it helps create healthy hair, which is essential for curly hair, especially with how much she loves to wear it down. So I'm just going to continue to brush and um, separate and brush her hair all throughout until I have a completely detangled head of hair. Now that her hair is completely detangled, I am going to go ahead and rinse it, but while I'm rinsing, I am going to continue to brush her hair and detangle it with my wet brush because her hair does get tangled very easily when we're in the shower as it's slowly starting to curl back up. So I'm just running my hands through it, finger combing it, and using my wet brush to make sure all the conditioner is out as well as all of the kinks. So now that I have detangled her hair and rinsed out all of the conditioner, I'm going to go ahead and just try to wring out as much water from her hair as I can so that we can move on to the next step of the lock method using the Dark and Lovely Eau Naturale product. Now I'm going to take my Super Quench Leave-In Spray and begin to spray that all over her hair and work it in with my fingertips and scrunch it into her curls as well. Now we're going to take our Soak It Up Oil Cocktail and just rub it all throughout her hair to help penetrate each strand for instant moisture and shine that doesn't leave a greasy buildup in her hair and I'm just rubbing it all throughout. And we're going to finish off using the Lock It In Sealing Cream just to add even more moisture and help keep the frizziness out of her curls. As you can see, I applied a fairly generous amount and just rubbed it all throughout her hair, scrunching it and rubbing it downwards to help create nice curls. And now I have completely finished. Here's her hair shortly after finish washing her off and finishing with our whole shower routine. I'm just gonna go ahead and let her hair air dry and allow her to wear it down and style it throughout the week. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.